Hello, beautiful people. It's Live in Color with me, Raven Danielle. And I have missed you guys so much. I know I've been missing in action, but I am back and I am ready to share. So, what do I want to talk to you about today? I would like to talk about being a vessel. What is a vessel? A vessel is a container that holds something. And that is exactly what we are. God created us to be containers, to hold things. Now, we can hold one of two things. We can either hold God and all of his good things, or we can hold the devil and all of his bad things. But what we want to do is we want to be containers and vessels for God. We want to hold the good things that he's put on the inside of us. We want those things to shine. So I'm actually going to be coming from 2 Timothy 2, 20 through 21. Now I'm reading the easy read version, but in King James, it says vessels. In here, it says things. So in a large house, there are things made of gold and silver, but there are also things made of wood and clay. Some of these things are used for special purposes, others for ordinary jobs. The Lord wants to use you for special purposes, so make yourself clean from all evil. Then you will be holy and the master can use you. You will be ready for any good work. So that scripture literally says it all. It says that God makes vessels, which is each and every one of us, to do different things. I need you to know right now that however God made you is just how he made you. He wanted you to be exactly how you are. That special thing that may bother you about yourself, that could be a gift that God gave you to reach a certain type of person or certain people. I need you to tap into God and figure out what it is that he's put on the inside of you so that you can continue to be a vessel for him. Remember, remember who you are in him. He's made you to be great. He's fearfully and wonderfully made you. And it says that in his word, you are amazing. You are awesome. Remember that. He's made you with a purpose. And yes, there are like 8 billion people on this earth. And he's given each and every single one of us a job to do. A gift that he's put on the inside to reach others. So don't sit there and think that you amount to nothing. And if you are sitting there and you do think you amount to nothing, I have to tell you. In fact, let me get closer. God loves you. And he created you and he made you with a purpose. He knows every single cell in your body. He knows how many hairs you have on your head. And he knows exactly why he's created you to be. He's made you a vessel to carry out his will in this earth, in this lifetime. You're going to carry out the things he wants you to do with your friends, with your family, with your co-workers, with anybody that you come in contact with. So just make sure that you know who you are in God. And you know what that takes? It takes praying. It takes reading the word. And it takes getting under some good people, going to a great church where there's a pastor and leadership that can help you. I want to push you today to find out what God has put on the inside of you so that you could be a vessel for him. Thank you so much for stopping by, beautiful people. I am so excited that I'm back. I have so many more things to share with you. So be on the lookout for some new and exciting videos. I love you and I hope you have an amazing day. Mwah.